Kevin Harrington is not at the conference, but the pamphlets or like the whole workshop is created like with his help or like in collaboration with Kevin Harrington. So he's not actually there, which is fine. It's a free workshop. Uh, yeah, so anyways, <laughs> I'm still going to go. I mean, just start getting ready and that was good because she's asleep. But yeah, um, I guess it's a good time to like talk to you guys too. Um, yeah, so if you stay updated, then let me move this up. If you do stay updated with, see this in focus. If you do stay updated with my, um, where's my eyebrow stuff? Oh, if you do stay updated with my main channel, um, you'll see like the updates on my rebranding. So what I did was pretty much like change like the name of the name of like my channel and kind of like the content that I will be doing. And it's more clear and focused and on what I want to do. So I made the decision not to. I know this is weird because I'm talking while I'm doing my makeup, so don't mind me, guys. I decided to not do any more, like, beauty videos. Like, beauty tutorials and product reviews around, like, beauty products. You know, I used to do, like, makeup tutorials and hair stuff. I'm, like, my passion just isn't there anymore for those types of things. And the more that I try to, to please like my viewers or at least what I thought what I was doing was like it felt like I didn't have like my heart in it and I was more obligated to make those videos than to than actually passionate about sharing those things so I made the decision not to do those anymore and go back to the organization videos that I used to do a lot of and that's kind of where I started with my YouTube channel like nine years ago I think eight nine years ago so just kind of going back to what I started YouTube for was like organization and I did like decor videos and like my room tours when I was in college and I think what really made my channel grow after that was like the school tips videos so again that's another like tips related video for organization and it is back to school season coming up it's like july now but everyone goes back to school like in august i believe and you know everyone wants to prepare for back to school time so i'm actually planning um more videos around that back to school things and it'll be really exciting um like super exciting for me to do i'm like more excited about the videos i'm putting out and if you notice the last three videos I did, I believe they're like organization videos, is it? I think, yeah, they're organization videos, like routines and how, like household things. And I thought I would start off with that because those were things I already do. So I might as well film it and share how I do things like that. And I remember like that's kind of what I was doing on my vlog channel. This channel was like showing you guys how I do things on the daily managing home stuff and I thought why can I just turn this into more like a tutorial so I can share with people so that's that that's what's been happening with that so the channel is different um not so much different it's just more specified I would say and like I still love may I still like makeup but, like I need to wear it and but I just don't see myself like investing in it anymore like buying products testing things um, those tutorials are just you know not what I think I can contribute I think there's other things that I can contribute from my channel in teaching people rather than like beauty products you know because there's a million and one beauty gurus and I just really don't think like I'm good enough like to compete with those types of like gurus that are like awesome and they're totally dedicated and I think I would just like set myself up for more failure if I 
try to even compete in that that niche that specific like beauty guru genre that has totally grown like out of control since I was doing that in like God, 2012 or I don't remember what year it was 2011 so things have totally changed and my lifestyle has totally changed I mean I'm more like at home mom and minimal at a lot of other things and I kind of center my focus on household things or things for my daughter so might as well cater to that type of um, audience and that's kind of where I'm going with that and I think my audience I hope has grown with me as well I mean I get comments too about people telling me like well I remember when I watched your school tips and I was in college and now I'm graduating and buying my first house and I'm like wow like that's amazing to know that they've grown up with me in that way and I think some of my viewers like the ones who leave comments on my channel and I've seen you guys like for years like I remember you guys you know and it's crazy to see how we've like all grown together you know we're talking about like makeup stuff and then all of a sudden we're talking about like family stuff it's just crazy how time flies by and that's just the new focus I'm doing on my channel and if you know people unsubscribe and that's not what they want to see then they can unsubscribe and I'll just um, try to get the new subscribers that want to see those type of videos like that type of demographic that I'm trying to go for and they'll appreciate it yeah that's where I'm going with my channel and thank you guys so much for just like dealing with me for so long like if you guys have been a long time subscriber to this channel oh my god like okay so last night I was I couldn't sleep because I think I took I took a nap earlier before like the usual time I sleep and I was like wired I couldn't sleep and I was on the computer and I just started like looking through my old vlogs by the way all my old vlogs they're like still on the channel but they're just private so I'm able to kind of look back on the ones I want to and it's so funny watching how I've grown like what the heck I'm sure you guys have seen it too but I don't think I really saw it until I actually saw it with my own eyes like on my vlogs like I was laughing so hard at what was I laughing at I was laughing so hard at myself like I was so I thought I was like really funny or like the way I reacted to things was funny to me now I'm like oh my god what was I even talking about or whatever and just time flies guys and you see yourself grow and develop which is like amazing to me that I'm able to see it through video because I did vlog before and just seeing how everything's changed pretty much like how I've changed and priorities change but oh my god I was like hilarious like <laughs> I was watching myself and I was like my reaction to things and I was like cracking up because I thought I was so funny like I just looked at myself I'm like gosh I was so immature about certain things um it was so funny and I think I'm just I just matured about a lot of things I mean I think just back then I just didn't have you know much ca not care about things but it's kind of just doing my own thing and um it's just funny that like that was my life before like i kind of did similar things to i'm doing now like before when i was like staying at home working on youtube and i used to work i think i was still working part-time at wet seal and my shirt so dirty but anyways, I had all the time in the world, and now, like, that I have Camille, I have my daughter, I just see how much I've changed, and it's crazy. Um, I've been working really hard on my main channel, and honestly, I've been, like, using this channel, like, this vlog channel to kind of 
help balance everything like like kind of also document things and balance everything in a way that I didn't want my main channel to like consume me but I think like it kind of has to for it to start being more successful in my goals so I've decided to like just kind of commit more time and energy into that channel to help with a another um, goal that I have for um, pretty much like another little business venture so yeah it's gonna be really exciting and I really hope that I get your guys support in all of this because you know I wouldn't be able to take this leap without knowing that I do have your guys support and that I have like people who will support me in like this thing that we're trying to launch so that'll be really exciting so I'll keep you guys updated I I'm not gonna say much on my main channel my main channel is gonna be more like strategic and how I release things but on here I think you know it's safe for me to like experiment talk about things kind of talk things out well it's such a relief guys I mean I was feeling more obligated to do those things rather than really geez, really wanting to do them and I think that's what was like stressing me out and just like stressing me out to the point where I felt like it's not what I wanted to do right and you don't want no one wants to do what they don't want to do and that was stressing me out so when I really thought about what I wanted to do what I wanted to accomplish like I wanted to do with YouTube from the start before it was about even money or anything was like helping people like tutorials and sharing things and tips that you know I do and getting guys feedback and that relationship that I had with my viewers like that's really what I want back and that's where my passion is and if I'm able to do that that would be that would be the goal and got these new lashes Demi Wispies, these are so great. Where's my lash glue? Um, yeah, that's my goal, guys. And I hope you guys know that. I always want to put out content that I know will like help somebody or, you know, someone searching for how to do this certain thing and I can be the video that they watch. It would be like amazing because that's pretty much what I want to do is just help others so being able to share that with Mitchell and him being like my little creative partner in all this is the dream so Mitchell and I have been doing so much brainstorming lately I don't know if you guys have seen it on my snapchat but like legit like we're always thinking and that's how we are like both of us are always like thinking about these things and Mitchell is a total opportunist if there's any opportunity to make x to make more money off of something he will find a way and um, you know it's so good to have someone like that because you're those are things like a quality that not everyone has and it's very positive and that helps me a lot and the fact that I can talk things out with him and he's not just he's not just like listening to listen and be like yeah that's great uh huh good job he's more like well what did you learn from that or what are you gonna do next time what are you gonna upload what is your plan like with him talking to me like that it really helps me think also and not just have it to myself to where like I'm freaking myself out because there's so much in my head that I can't express to someone we've been doing a lot of brainstorming and it's been so helpful that we need more room to brainstorm I mean if we could have a whole entire wall dedicated to brainstorming and like screens everywhere that's what we would do like we would so want to do that with like graphs and notes and bullet points and deadlines okay so we are ready to go it took us like an extra hour after that to get ready Camille is ready. I packed her bag and I got ready. I straightened my hair. 
And then I'm wearing my blazer over it. This one's from Banana Republic. You see that? Yeah, I got this a while ago, but I thought I'd wear a blazer. You know, I pack them because I'm like, I'm gonna wear them and haven't worn them yet. So I have a blazer, but I kept it casual with wearing some like distressed jeans. Yeah, so I'm like semi-casual because I don't know how people are gonna be dressed and I don't wanna be underdressed and overdressed. I'm kinda in the middle. Um, I brought my business cards, my vlog camera, a notebook, pen. What a cheater. <laughs>